Hey guys, this is Chris, and in this video tutorial, I'm going to be demonstrating to you a software tool that can help you to speed up your computer, and it's called RegCure Pro. You can find this at regcurepro.org, uh, and you can see where you can download it right here. And actually, if you want to do that, you can follow along with me as I take you through the demonstration, and by the time you're done, you're going to notice a huge improvement over your computer speed and, and the overall performance. So that's regcurepro.org. When you download it and install it, you're going to see a screen similar to this. Now, I recently ran uh, a scan on my computer and went ahead and fixed all the problems I had, and there was over 2,000 issues, and a lot of that includes just temporary files, which is why there were so many items. I haven't ran the scan for some time, and I've had this software for, it's probably been going close to a year, and I periodically run it, sometimes once every couple weeks, sometimes like this time. It's been about a month since I ran it, which is why I have so many items that needed fixed. But it overall keeps my computer performing at uh, top speed, top performance. And um, I know, you know, you, you guys, I'm sure, just as well, have times when you try to load your computer and it doesn't want to load or start up. It takes forever. And other times you're on your computer trying to access the internet or some program or document on your computer. It just seems like it takes forever for that file to load and to go. And it's just, you just feel like you're waiting forever. And that's what this tool does. It actually, uh, it reorganizes and fixes all these issues with your computer that allows it to work together again, just like it did when you first bought your computer. And so here's how it works. Um, it really, it's, it's simple because it does all the work for you. Um, at the overview screen, you're going to check all these boxes. I recommend you keep all of them checked because what it does is it checks for system problems. It'll check for malware, things like viruses. It'll also check for your overall system performance, things that it can tweak and modify to make it faster. Privacy protection, it'll get rid of a lot of files stored on your computer that your computer keeps there until you delete it. And it's an easy way for hackers to get a hold of these files and it'll, it'll go through and scan, find these files and delete them so you won't have to worry about that issue. And then there's also junk files like temporary internet files and things that just randomly build up over time with things that you do on the computer. And so once you uh, leave all these check marked, you want to go down to System Scan and it's going to automatically start scanning. As you can see here, the first thing it's going to do is scan for system problems. And then it's going to scan for malware, things like viruses, spyware, trojans. It's going to uh, go through and identify areas of your computer that will allow it to boost the speed and performance. Um, then it'll go through your, like I said, your privacy items and your junk files, and it's going to fix all those. And uh, I'm not going to go through this yet because it'll take a few minutes. And yes, she does talk to you. So uh, it's got a restore place where you can uh, set up restore points. I've never had to use that yet. It has a lot of additional built-in tools. It has a process manager, which just shows you your overall performance of your computer. A startup manager, this is really neat. It allows you to stop um, things from booting, uh, stop programs from loading as your computer is starting up, which will allow it to load a lot faster. Because many times, when you download and install certain programs or tools on your computer, they'll automatically set up to load when your computer starts. And because it does this, it really uh, makes your load time for your computer a lot slower so you can deactivate those here. File manager um, this here is really neat because with this you can type in an extension of a file and it'll tell you the kind of software you need to run it. For example if you type in uh, PDF if you go find software it's going to tell you that uh, a PDF extension requires Adobe Reader and you can download it free right here. So if you got files on your computer that you can't open up uh, you can just type in the extension right here. That's the that's the last letters of the file. Usually it'll say you know .pdf .exe or something like that, and then it'll tell you the file you need for that. So it's a really neat tool. And defrag. Now your computer has a defrag built in it, and what it does, it just puts a button here for you to access it easier, and it has its own little interface that it uses for it. And then this is really neat. This is a browser object manager. Now, you may have times when you load your browser, your internet browser, and you'll see a bunch of toolbars up the top, like Yahoo, shopping, coupons, just things that, and then you start getting ads, and, and it start taking you to websites you don't want to go to, and when you open up your home page, it takes you to a page you don't want to be at. This gets rid of those. 
So you can come in here and you can just disable all these things or just the ones that you know. Uh, like you may have one that says something to do with coupons or something to do with um, you know ads, I don't know, whatever. And you can just uncheck those and it will automatically remove those from your toolbar and you don't have to worry about them no more. And then it has uh, settings where you can go in here and you can just modify settings. Uh, I've never messed with these. I've left everything the way they are. The tools, um, I use these occasionally, not very often. The Startup Manager and the Browser um, Object Manager, I'll, I'll go in there and remove some of those toolbars once in a while if I download a lot of stuff. But overall, the um, software works incredibly well at keeping your computer clean and optimized, allowing it to perform at top speed. So if, if you're having a problem with your computer speed, guys, this software will fix that for you. It's going to go through and clean everything. Like I said, it may take a few minutes, especially if you've never used software like this before and it's never went through and cleaned out your computer. It may take a while and, you, and you'll probably notice that this level may go clear up to red on these if you've never done this before. Um, in my case, I probably won't have very many errors at all because I just, like I said earlier, I just uh, went through and scanned and fixed everything. So you can see right now it's not finding nothing. So it's very effective at what it's doing. You can see here they're even a Microsoft partner. So this isn't just some really cheap made software that, that some company built, but they are a legit software. Works extremely well and you will see a significant improvement over the speed of your computer by using it. And so uh, if you want to check it out, just go to uh, regcurepro.org and you can uh, download a free trial that allow you to run the scan on your computer and show you everything that needs corrected on it and then uh, down here will be a button to fix it and if you haven't bought it you will have to buy it to fix it and I believe it's around twenty or thirty dollars something like that it's not very expensive for what it does because it has a lot of tools built into it um, that normally you'd have to buy separately that would cost you probably close to a hundred dollars each one of these is, is pretty much a tool of its own and so it's, it's a really great deal but I just wanted to show you guys uh, how you can speed up your computer by using this software and I hope it works well for you